Hey friends and welcome back to my channel, Organized with Joy. You may notice I am in a different location and if you've been following me on Instagram or have seen some of my most recent videos, then you know that I've been helping my son move to Portland, Oregon. And so I am in his apartment right now and I wanted to share with you everything he decluttered on this side of the move. Sometimes when you move, you don't know exactly what's gonna work in your space and so you take along what might work um, or I'll talk about some of the other reasoning why we are decluttering some of these items and I apologize for my appearance I just got back from a run but I need to get this video filmed for you so I'm just going with it but before I forget this is a monthly collaboration that I do. It is a decluttering and minimalism collaboration. And if I have some friends joining me this month sharing their own decluttering or minimalism content, I will be sure to link that playlist in the description box below. But let me show you everything my son decluttered this month. Also, I'm sitting here in the corner by my son's new plant baby. <laughs> Meet his new plant baby. So this was kind of the best setup that I found. You get a minimalist background situation going on here, but let's get into what he decluttered. Okay, first up, this is actually just a portion of this. This is a drape rod. It is really long and his previous couple apartments on UT's campus, um, he had kind of a long wall with uh, windows where we could hang the drape rod, but this drape rod did not work in this apartment. So we're gonna go ahead and declutter that. And along those lines, we also have some drapes. So these were the drapes that were in his apartment this past year. And I'm kind of sad to let these go because um, they're really pretty. They're like a navy velvet. However, this apartment has really tall ceilings. And so um, the way I like to hang drapes is at the top of the ceiling. It just looks a lot more aesthetic. It makes the room look more luxurious. And so we decided to just go ahead and purchase new drapes for this space. And I actually saved some old drapes of mine because I knew um, in his previous apartment it was studio. This is a one bedroom. So I knew he was going to have two spaces to have drapes. He has um, his bedroom and then here in the living room. So I had saved these in case these would work here. But again, they're just too short. We wanted to buy ceiling to floor length drapes. He also decluttered um, a couple of sheet sets. And the reason why we are decluttering these is because he has used these for the last several years while he was in college and they just needed to be replaced honestly so uh, we got some new sheets for his bed and we're gonna go ahead and declutter these we're hoping to find some sort of animal shelter to take these to um, that is a little tip because a lot of times i think goodwill would probably just throw these in a dumpster i'm not totally sure but um, if you take them to an animal shelter, they're more likely to be used there. We also have some kitchen items that we will be decluttering. There was a couple of kitchen tools, I guess you call them kitchen. What do you call these? There's a word for it. Utensils. <laughs> there are a couple of kitchen utensils that he had in his apartment on campus that he really never used honestly these were passed down from my daughter's apartment when she was in college she might have used these but he did not and then um, we did get him new dishes only because the dishes that he was using he had two cups <laughs> two bowls <laughs> and two plates and these were all dishes, again, that were passed down from his sister. She had used them when she was in college and then she had moved home with us, so she didn't need separate dishes. And so we just passed them along to him, but we decided to just go ahead and get him some new dishes. So we're gonna uh, go ahead and declutter those. So, actually, one more thing. I almost said that was everything. There's one more thing. 
lastly is this doormat that he had outside of his apartment and i don't know if it's picking up on camera but it's in really bad shape it got very weathered over the last year at his um, apartment in austin so we also replaced that as well um that honestly i will probably throw in the trash because it's really not in good condition but that was everything he decluttered for this month y'all oh my gosh just kidding this is the end of it i forgot about these because i left them in my son's hall closet we are getting rid of this old vacuum cleaner again this was something that my daughter had in her apartment so it's it's very old because she used it in college and then my son used it in college. And then um, this e-cloth mop I had given him when I replaced this for myself in my own home with a steam mop. But what we decided to do here is to just get a cordless vacuum mop combo just to make it super simple for him to clean up his apartment. The apartment has kind of like a engineered wood floor and then we have a rug down here in the living room um, so that'll be a lot easier for him than dragging out this old vacuum cleaner not to mention this vacuum cleaner does not work very well at all so it was good to invest in a new vacuum for my son so that is all for this month okay friends i have really missed being here on youtube i'm so excited to be posting again i will definitely have content for you in september if you're interested in seeing content here in my son's apartment if you're not yet subscribed definitely subscribe to my channel hit the bell notification so that you don't miss any future videos that i'm going to be posting i have a whole series working here in my son's apartment doing um, a lot of organization here in a small apartment decluttering and yeah just um content for you homemaking type content here in my son's apartment as i've been helping him get settled so definitely be on the lookout throughout september i will be posting that content also be sure to look at my description box to find that playlist link if you want even more decluttering and minimalism motivation for your day and as always i really appreciate you watching my video all the way until the end and i will see you next time bye